Hello, I'm Kevin Watler and this is your CMR Daily Buzz. Here's a summary of some of Cayman's latest headlines. Her Excellency the Governor, Mrs. Jane Owen, took her oaths of office and allegiance as the 15th Governor of the Cayman Islands during the swearing-in ceremony held in the House of Parliament on Friday. Chief Justice the Honorable Margaret Ramsey Hale administered the oaths to Mrs. Owen, the second woman to be the Governor of the Cayman Islands. Deputy Premier and Minister of Education, the Honorable Juliana O'Connor Connolly, has announced that she will step away from politics in two years. Now in her seventh consecutive term as a Member of Parliament, O'Connor Connolly is the longest-serving female member and the first woman to become Deputy Premier and Premier of the Cayman Islands. Member of Parliament for West Bay West, McKeever Bush was appointed to Parliament's Public Accounts Committee following a government motion during a special sitting of Parliament on Friday. Mr. Bush, who is currently facing charges of assault before the court, will replace the Member of Parliament for Bodentown East and Minister of Border Control and Labour Dwayne Seymour, who resigned from the committee in April. Cayman's native snails are threatened by the rosy wolf snail or cannibal snail, an evasive snail that eats other snails and slugs. The Department of Environment is asking the public to help find the snail before it does irreversible harm to Cayman's native snail populations. Water Authority Cayman says it is having difficulty meeting the needs of its trucked water customers as it continues experiencing a high demand for water. Water Authority also explained that due to the high demand, water production plants must be operated continuously with less downtime for maintenance. Now to carry out maintenance, the plants needs to be taken offline, and when a plant is offline, the volume of water in the reservoir decreases. This means that a careful balance needs to be struck between the continuing operation of the plant and taking it offline to improve production capacity. Now for your CMR weather update, it's brought to you by WG Charters. Sunrise just after 6, sunshine and clouds will be mixed when the temperature is at 87 degrees Fahrenheit and humidity at 62% like the forecast calls for. It will feel like it's in the low 90s. Winds east southeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour and the sun sets at 646. At nighttime, the temperature falls to the high 70s. Looking forward, similar weather conditions are expected. If you would like to know more on any of these stories, visit caymanmallroad.com or follow Cayman Mall Road on Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, Twitter, and YouTube. That's it for now on The Daily Buzz. Thank you for joining me. Please stay safe and God bless.